hello guys welcome back to another vlog thank you for joining me and if you're new here welcome of course to you guys too today is my birthday i cannot believe it actually i can believe it i turned 32 today it sounds so real okay we're just gonna relax and just bypass that i feel like definitely covid stole some of those years i feel like i should at least just be 29 i reckon but with that being said of course i'm really grateful to at least see another year thanks to god it's been another great year and we can only hope that the next year is the best so let's get into today's vlog it is midday i've spent the whole of yesterday decluttering i got rid of a load of stuff onto vinted and then i got rid of three no two bags of um clothes to donate so i dropped it off last night i feel like a huge weight has been lifted and i think it was quite nice to do that before my birthday you know just to clear up a bit i still have a lot of clearing up to do uh, that's a whole different story but today is my birthday vlog my last few birthdays i think since my 30th obviously i had a huge dinner for my 30th i had family come down from gloucester and my friends were there and then last year what did I do? I did a hotel stay also. I did that the previous year too, but last year I did a hotel stay. My point is, is that Fatma would usually organise something for my birthday and then I'd do it for the twins. Twins is Fatma and her twin, Neri. I'm really not that person who's bothered about my 30th. Like, I'm good to just go out and eat. Um, so that's what we're going to do. But the only thing with this is I don't know where we're going out to eat. I just know it's somewhere nice um, and to dress fancy, you know? And I got a really really cute outfit guys oh my god it's so nice you'll have to see later i'll link all the items down below because it ate it ate guys my sister messaged me yesterday which i knew she was coming down for my meal like i knew that much she messaged me yesterday and said meet me at london bridge for three o'clock and the fact that it's two o'clock right now is making me want to speak even faster i'm assuming we've got a spa evening and a hotel stay which would be nice to go back to a hotel after the meal oh my god i'm so excited to see what restaurant it is i really 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 think that it might be nobu it might be no boom. I'm trying to think of where I've said before where I'd like to go and eat. We shall see. So we'll see if it's no boom. And if it's no boom, remember this moment. I have packed. I'm going to finish off just put, putting my actual outfit in there. I just had to make a TikTok. Oh yeah, I took my hair out. I need to, this is me just trialing out. I saw this TikToker. She did her hair like this and I was like, oh my God, that would be absolutely perfect for my birthday hairstyle to go with my outfit. Um, so yeah, thank God she did like it kind of like a tutorial i literally got this ribbon from hobby craft yesterday for like two pounds it wasn't even two pounds it was like one pound 68 or something so yeah it kind of works i just want to make this a bit thicker because at the moment it kind of just looks like a horse's tail which i feel like there is literally no way of avoiding that but I, oh my god it's so cute look at that oh my god yeah i'm gonna fix it up a little bit for this evening but i definitely needed to know how it would look before i left out otherwise i would have been stressing um so yeah we're gonna go head out see what's going on <laughs> in London Bridge, Lena's here. After her, actually this, this trip wasn't long down. Tomorrow's gonna be long back, right? Yeah. Let's see, oh, this is nice. This is really nice. Okay. Got cake from the top baker. Okay. Sorry about the lighting, guys. It's not the best here right now. Well, I can do this. Oh, that's the... No, that's actually like the perfect size. That is the sweetest, the cutest but cake you can I've see ever seen. Because right? yeah. I was thinking, oh my God, I'm going to get a huge cake, which means I'm going to have to eat. It's not, not even carry, eat an entire cake. I think I should just tie it up for now, don't you think? My little mm. horse's tail. Yeah, do that. Oh my God, this is so cute. The ribbon is the new thing. I got this from Hobbycraft. Just chopped yeah. it up. Sick, isn't it? Yeah. Let me give you guys a room tour hotel room tour the only annoying thing about this hotel room is the fact that there's not um a lot of lighting but other than that it's perfect loving the brown tones i love like brown woods i know that sounds mad but yeah i prefer brown wood to like the the chestnut one lovely bed here desk here 
TV, which I don't know. TVs never get turned on when I stay at hotels, but we'll see. I did bring my laptop, my phone with all my TikTok drafts. Sofa, which Shalina thought that we was gonna turn into a bed, but that's not gonna burn. I had to tell her, I said, me and my friends share beds. When I go on a holiday, we share beds. Well, there's a huge bed right there. What are we giving on sofa for? Is this what you paid for? Well, quite yeah. Pay. What's going to be more comfortable, this or this? I don't know, because I like floor, so... <laughs> Not the best view. They could have put us higher. And considering we're in London Bridge, they could have put us out there. But who can complain? And this is the lovely lighting, which we will be relying on today, <laughs> tonight. And guys, the main character. Should Come I on, Shalina. Let's do it. I'm going to press the button. Let's do it. Right. Three. Right, well, let me show you. Can you see me? <laughs> I actually can. But like... I can't see you naked, naked. It's a blur, right? Wait, I'm going to count down. One, two, three. Boom. Oh, bam. So, yeah, that's what happens here. <laughs> but might but be eating in the bathroom. <laughs> and these... I know. And these... Um, this is the door. It's like... It's like the cupboards. These are the, mm. this is the door to the bathroom. So it's very, um, it's definitely given aesthetics, right? A nice toilet space. And then, oh, this is where we could do makeup. Yeah. Um, some lovely space here. Um, and then there's the, the shower bath situation we got going on. If I could do, actually, maybe if I go here, so like it looks better. We are at, the Novotel London Bridge. Well, we have to go. Shalina's, oh my God, look at my lashes. Lash tech. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, the lighting, please sort yourself out. It's been like an hour or so and we've just come back from the spa. So they make, they say it's a spa, but I think they're a bit cheeky because it's a sauna room, a steam room, and then a shower, so. I guess it is a spa. There just wasn't a pool. I don't know why we was, we was expecting a pool. There was no pool there. So in reference, if anyone plans on coming here, there's no swimming pool. And I think the Tower Bridge one has a swimming pool and the Canary Wharf one. But anyway, we are, it just means that we've got that bit more time to get ready and I can make content and not have to rush. So that's a plus. Wait until you see how gorgeous the earrings are and the bracelet is from Carrot London. I'm genuinely like so grateful for this because I know they're quite a pricey brand. Um, so yeah, another blessing for the year. Everything that you see from Pull and Bear from me for the foreseeable, it is gifted because I collaborate with them. I'm a part of the influencer program. So yeah, I got this from Pull and Bear, really nice oversized blazer. And this is from Oh Polly. This skirt is so tiny, but it does work and trust the process because it looks so cute. You might have already seen the whole fit if you're following me on TikTok and Instagram. If you have, then let me know what you think about it down below. Um, and then, statement piece. <sighs> These boots are from Pull and Bear, banging. I always think I need something that's like out there when it's my birthday and because I've got like a nude fit, the boots were perfect. I was just saying to my sister, it, out of all times, I haven't had a spot on my face in absolutely months. And guess what appeared two days ago? This little friend of mine. I'm gonna put some music on. <laughs> Patma just told me that she's leaving her house now and it's 6.15. Time to beat my face. Do you have some? Yeah, this is way too long. I want to cut it like this. It looks cute. This is so nice. The back just hangs like up. And look at the, how this is shining. Ooh. How nice is that? Mm. Guys, it's glistening. That it's not so really nice. showing it there, but. Some Tom Ford on. Black Orchid for reference. Yeah, this is basically it. I think it's given a little bit of sass, but also very. Minimal, so yeah, just gonna pop the blazer on. We've taken me to the shard. We were talking about this earlier. 
really a puppy broadcast show. And Lena acted like she was oblivious. Oh my god, we should go there one year. <laughs> We're at the freaking charge with the most stunning freaking view of London. We are just waiting for the girls to come. They're still stuck in traffic. But yeah, I've got myself a porn star martini. She got the same. Um, and some olives. I'm thinking I can probably take one when I'm outside. When I'm outside, standing up short. Standing up. <laughs> <laughs> I got this worse before whatever, I got hired. Whatever. I got this before I got oh hired. my god. Guys, I need to take pictures of you. Me. Girls, for you. I need to take my blazer off. Please help me take my blazer off. No, it's a blazer, it's not a cold. <laughs> to double up my pillows literally just woke up it's 9 a.m um and we're gonna go head down for breakfast because head breakfast is included last night was so sweet oh my god when we arrived at the at the shard i didn't realize what it was i was looking up because obviously it's really tall so you can easily identify it but I cannot see up because it had like a i don't know like a bit covering it so i was like are we at the shard so I didn't realise until we went inside, there was no hint of it anywhere that said the shard or anything. So yeah, that was a nice surprise. I hadn't ate at the shard before, like literally not once. And I think I even mentioned it to Fatma the other week. I was like, I've never been to the shard before. But oh my God, it was so nice. The food was really good. At first I thought it was just that first section, like the bar area that we were going to. And I was so happy with that because the service there was so nice even when the lady came up to us and she was like are you going anywhere else after this and I was thinking no like this is my birthday meal until Fatmo Neri came and she was Neri was Fatmo was like we're going upstairs to the actual restaurant and I was like oh okay like I was happy with just like that first restaurant bit the views were freaking stunning like how gorgeous was that um but yeah had a really lovely time and today we're gonna go for breakfast i'm gonna head home and make content because i didn't actually get to make my um carrot lending content last night but me and my sister was just talking so much whilst getting ready before we knew it it was time to go god another year down guys um, thank you guys for all of the love oh my god i received so much love and still i've woken up to more dms so shout out to you guys really appreciate it <laughs> Um, and I've got a lot of freaking luggage. The only reason that I'm able to talk to you guys whilst on the train is because there's literally no one on this train. I'm a few stops from my my actual stop. I need to go home and make some content. Luckily, Fam has offered to pick me up because I was like, I've got so much stuff. And she was like, oh, I'll just come and get you. And I said, you're, this is why you're amazing. You're actually amazing. <laughs> I was sorting through my vintage bits. I didn't realise, actually I kind of did realise how much was sold with the options that I have for my buyers. It's like every 
or impost but it's more convenient for me to go with impost just because of the location where the lockers are at that everyone is just a bit of a difficult situation like with the impost I could just walk down the road and it's there but with the every store I feel like because it's like a corner shop I don't know it's quite a weird store like they decide when they want to be open or closed so like I could go there at like 1pm and they'd be closed so they're not really reliable so I don't really like the option of every I'm gonna go to another one down the road and um, so I'm gonna take all of these bits so I've divided it so I'm gonna do every today which is got the majority of bags and parcels and then tomorrow I'll do in post which is easier guys seriously don't watch my bag but like is that not crazy so i've had to just separate it so i know what's what when it comes to me scanning it. and then here it's literally just a few for every i mean for impost i haven't completed those bits because i have to print out some of the labels i don't know why it gave me the option instead of the other option but yeah whatever let's go <laughs> on tiktok this lady she's got like four kids yeah. and she just like stands in front of tiktok yeah. in front of a camera she cooks the meals for her kids i have to show you it's so interesting this is what she does i feel like her mom what mom i do this well. no 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 you actually need to assist me i swear it's just oh thank you no what's that what's that yeah oh. You no then what? twist the can to remove it. Twist it. Nah, that's mad. Alright. I don't think I've seen cinnamon in like cream version. We don't know what we're doing. <laughs> that's your rolling. I blame oh. your rolling for that. So Fatma didn't listen to how you make ice and sugar, so this is what we're having to work with. You have to do it little by little with ice and sugar. Right, before I close off this vlog, what a lovely week I have had. I love myself a birthday vlog, so that was fun to edit. Oh my God, let me not put too much on like I did before. I am actually thinking about doing a giveaway for you guys, so make sure you're subscribe to my channel so you're aware of when this happens and make sure you like this video so I know that you guys actually want to give away. With all of the collabs I've been getting I can definitely combine loads of these bits and give back to you guys and I feel like it's kind of like a thank you from me to you guys for always supporting me so it'd be nice to do a giveaway like I said make sure you like comment and subscribe definitely make sure you're liking my videos the more engagement I get on my channel the faster I can grow the more likely I am to do giveaways and yeah let's do this guys but like I said thanks for watching